So this was a combination study looking at oral rigocertib and standard dose parenteral azacitidine in patients with both MDS and AML. In the phase one portion of the study, we looked at both MDS, AML, and CMML patients, and we used escalating dose cohorts of rigocertib um, along with standard dose azacitidine. We found that the combination was safe and well tolerated, and the adverse uh, if the adverse uh, event profile was similar to single agent azacitidine alone. And then in the phase two portion of the study, we used um, a fixed dose of rigocertib of 560 milligrams in the morning, 280 milligrams in the afternoon with azacitidine. And um, we studied it in patients with MDS and CMML. And in the MDS patients, um, we saw a overall response rate of 76%, and that included an 85% um, response rate uh, in patients who had never received hypomethylating agents and 62% in those who were um, who had HMA failures. And so these are um, that HMA failure population is a population that's difficult to treat because there are no standard therapies for them. Um, and then we also saw about a 24% um, CR rate in the HMA naive population, which is better than uh, the standard therapies in terms of uh, CR rates. So we saw some promising results for the combination. And then in the AML population, we saw an overall response rate of about 37.5%.